We got the Fighting Energy, uh, Rebombi Hollow, Keldeo, Manaphy, Heatran, Shaman. I see an old school card. Oh no! No! Dude. What's good everybody, Darko here, back at it again with another video. But in today's video, ladies and gentlemen, first and foremost, I appreciate the support in yesterday's video. So yes, I will be continuing the golden hunt for the gold Ultra Necrozma. That made absolutely no sense, but just go with it, guys. But like I said, I'm going to be continuing that series. But before I release another episode for that series, I need to gain my sanity back for Dragon Majesty because I don't want to get tired of that set and I don't want to end up hating that set. You feel me? Because I absolutely love dragons and I love that set in general. So we just got to take it down a notch with the Dragon Majesty just so I can still enjoy and open up that set at the same time. Because I don't want to make it seem like a chore, you know, opening up Dragon Majesty over and over and over and over. And guys, Yes, I do know Lost Thunder is basically here. I do know Dragon Majesty brand new products have dropped. I'm waiting for the premium box to arrive from the mail. Lost Thunder, I'm going to try to get some product in. Maybe this upcoming week, like on the weekdays and whatnot, because I know there's pre-releases going on. I might attend a pre-release over here in Vegas. Who knows? If you guys see me there, shouts out to you because I'm probably going to give something out if you guys do see me there. But that's not the point, guys. That is not the point. Because I'm not even sure if I'm going to be going to a pre-release. I might just get the pre-release kit and then bounce. You feel me? Mainly because I am complete garbage at the Pokemon TCG. Like, I just play for fun. I'm a casual player. You feel me? So, with that being said, guys. In today's video, we got, yes, presence from Pidgey. A.K.A. the series where you guys send me fan mail and I open it up. And if you guys ever want to send me fan mail... My P.O. box is in the description down below, so make sure you guys check that out if you guys do want to send me anything, because anything you guys send me will be opened up in a video. Doesn't matter what it is, doesn't matter if it's just a letter, just a drawing, whatever the case may be, it's going to be in this series, you feel me? So, I did implement a couple packages that I bought from, like, eBay, Facebook sellers and whatnot in this video. So, with that being said, guys, we got a mystery box, kinda. Well, basically, I just stuffed every single fan mail into a box that this fan mail person sent me and called it a super mystery box, I guess you can call it. I don't know, guys. I don't know. But if you are excited for today's video, smash that like button. And don't forget to subscribe, enjoy the ghoul army, and welcome. And don't forget to turn on that bell for post notifications just so you never miss a video. Because if you do, then you could be featured in a video like these individuals that you see right here on the screen. All you got to do is comment anything you want down below, but put the hashtag ghoul army. With that being said, guys, give me one second so I can actually grab the mystery box. Alrighty, guys, are you ready? In three, two, one, here it is right there. You know, we got a little priority box right here. And we got basically all the fan mail inside here. So we're going to open things up one by one. And we'll see what kind of hidden treasures that you guys sent through. So we're actually going to save the box for last because it's a box. You feel me? The biggest does have to be last. And let's just go ahead and start with the first thing, y'all. And let's see what we get. So let's go ahead and do a quick money shot. Ooh. Oh, okay. Okay. Hold up. Hold up. Let's see what we got. We got a code card right off the bat. And then it looks like, yo, this is, is this their Pokemon collection? They actually printed it out? Yo, that's actually really dope. I've never gotten, you know, somebody to show me their Pokemon collection like this. They got a Machamp level X right there. They got a Shay Shay. They got some EX cards. They got some full art. Secret rare action, guys. Check that out. That's actually really, really dope right there. It's a pretty sweet collection. Hint, hint. That Lugia right there is actually worth, oh, you got that Charizard. That might be like the first edition, not the first edition, but the unlimited and whatnot from base set. So that's actually a pretty sweet collection right there. I don't think there was a note included, but we did get a pin, a Mewtwo pin, ladies and gentlemen. Looks absolutely amazing, although I do prefer Mewtwo. Why? But I'm not a picky guy, you feel me? That actually rhymed. Hey, okay, I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna stop. But let's go ahead and check out what is in this, oh, baby, we got something. We got a ton of code cards, though, that is for sure. And y'all already know that I give out all of these code cards 
in every single video i also give out additional code cards on my instagram so make sure you guys follow me on my instagram this is the last one i'm gonna give out in today's video and then i'm gonna give out the rest on my instagram and all of that good stuff guys so like i said make sure you guys follow me on my instagram if you want some free code cards as well as you know giveaways and all that good stuff i try to make my instagram lit as possible y'all already know how i do but let's continue the video guys let's continue y'all so let's see what is in this stack of cards right here so we got a pokemon fan club right off the bat y'all that is in freaking insane man I love Bonsley though. Is that a doll? I'm pretty sure that's just a doll though. We got the Duskmane Necrozma Holographic, y'all. That Fire Energy Hollow. That Pikachu Hollow. Poly. Oh, you know how I love my Mewtwo's, man. That is absolutely beautiful. We got that Darkrai. And this card is actually a fake Darkrai if you were not aware. But like I said, I don't discriminate. That's going straight into the fake collection biter. You feel me? So then we got, ooh, we got an EX Legend. Yo, I need, I need to get a sleeve for this, my guy. Because that is actually a really dope looking card right there, man. Check that out. We got that Gengar from EX Legend Maker, guys. Very, very vintage card right here. This is a reverse. In case you guys didn't know, reverses back then used to have you know the hollow foil pattern on the artwork and then they have the set stamp on the artwork itself so very very nice right there we got that gardevoir holographic which is a galaxy foil and we got the mewtwo gx let's get it man we got the mars shadow dude dude we got the Articuno EX! No freaking way! You know, I don't care about the condition because y'all already know how I feel about my EX series, dude. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to take it out of the sleeve you put it in, and I actually have to give it one of these, you know, sturdier sleeves because that is absolutely crazy, my guy. Oh my god, this card is beautiful! Now I just need the Zapdos and the Moltres. And I got the whole set, bruh. And I actually spit on my mouth. That's disgusting, guys. Hopefully you guys didn't see that. But I pointed it out, so I'm pretty sure someone in the comments is gonna, you know, put a little timestamp. But let's just keep our attention on this Articuno EX, please, because it is absolutely beautiful, man. I love the Shard Hollow on that EX card. It goes stupid insane, you feel me? But dang, man, we're lucky we don't do Star of the Show on fan mail openings because I don't want to be picky when it comes down to, you know, cards that you guys send. So we got the Hydreigon Break, the Starmie Break. We got some vintage action going on right here. Wait, 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 wait. Hold up, hold up. Never mind. This isn't vintage. I forgot like Ultra Prism, you know, all of the newer Sun and Moon sets did a bunch of reprint cards with a bunch of old artworks because I remember this Chinchou from an EX series set. So we got that Reshiram Hollow and we got the Rayquaza Seed, bruh. Look at that. With baby girl Cynthia as the primary trainer. Y'all already know how it do, man. That is beautiful. I'm sorry, but this is going to have to go into my vintage collection instead of the fan binder. Or actually, I'm going to put it in the fan binder just so we can do an actual review of the entire fan binder, guys. I'm just waiting to fill it up and then we're going to do our own exclusive video so you guys can see what you have created with the fan binder so far. So dang, man, a bunch of bangers in this little small card lot right here. But there's no name, man. Hold up. I'm going to check the letter one more time because I want to see if there's a name. Alrighty, guys. So there wasn't like a little letter within the package, but it is from the homie Austin. So shouts out to you, Austin. You are the real MVP, bruh. And you didn't have to send that Articuno, man. That is just absolutely I'll love my guy. I'll freaking love, man. That is it's absolutely amazing. We got another package, y'all, but y'all already know what that means. Another money shot. Ooh, we got custom Pokemon packs right here. Is that everything? No, 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 no. I don't want to forget that letter. Y'all already know that letter. Be the most important. Oh, we got another thing, actually. It might be like for a signed card or something like that. We'll see. We'll see. Alrighty, guys. Let's check out the first thing that we got right here. Can you please not give out all of the code cards? I got you, bruh. I won't give them all out. If you want me to, I can like redeem some on the online TCGO. And I'll probably do like an opening in the future if you want me to. If you don't want me to give away everything, just let me know and I won't. And let's see what this is right here. Let's see what this is. Hold up, hold up. I think this is a no. So Dark Ghoul, I basically gave you all of my Pokemon cards 
fast time last time, so I will give you the rest. Can you sign the Chin Chow for me, please? I got you, because like I said, you don't have to send me anything, guys. You don't have to send me your Pokemon card collection. But if you do, I appreciate anything. I appreciate anything. And in return, I got you. I'll send you the Chin Chow. I'll sign it for you, because, you know, you're the homie. And I, I love every single one of you. You know, female, male, whatever the case may be. Y'all are the homies, and y'all are part of the ghoul freaking army, bruh. So let's see what we got. We got a custom pack, custom pack, special booster pack, Pokemon custom booster pack. So we're going to save the special one for last. I don't know. Should I save? Let's save the blue ones for last because I feel like when you add color onto something, it's a little more high end. Does that make any sense? I don't think it does, but we're just going to keep it rolling. You feel me? Alrighty, guys. First custom pack. Let's see what we get, guys. Oh, I don't want to damage any of the cards. Hold up. Hold up. I got to open this a little bit more better. Oh, my God. Is the card or one of the cards stapled? Oh, no. You stapled one of the cards. Oh, no, no. Let's see who it is. Let's see who it is. You actually stapled two cards. The Grand Bull and the Pokemon Catcher. That is unfortunate, but, you know, not too much damage. And you actually damaged this one as well. So we got a Metapod right there. Okay, let's see. Oh, what? What? I was not expecting that. Holy crap. We got the Arceus level 100 water type, man. And I'm pretty sure that was the basically the ultra rare of the pack oh my god guys that is freaking insane i freaking love these cards because arceus can basically be any type it wants to be so then they made a card for every single typing in the tcg with an arceus on it and that that is beautiful man just arceus looks good in blue i'm not even gonna lie just look at the artwork on that card bro that's crazy that is crazy if this is what the regular custom packs oh no 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 okay is there a pack trick i don't even know dude let's just shut let's just open it up normally so we got a floor just holographic comfy hollow we got fairy type hollows left and right we got the fighting energy uh rebombi hollow keldeo manaphy heatran shaman i see an old school card oh no no Dude, 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 dude. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, guys. I'm so freaking hyped, bro. Oh my god. I don't know what to think right now, man. Oh man. You know I'm a nerd when I get this hype for a freaking Pokemon card. Oh my god, dude. My voice is cracking. What is life right now, bro? We got that Mew EX. Oh, I remember having this card when I was younger. Like, I remember this artwork, but I obviously I sold the card. My mom sold all of my Pokemon cards in a yard sale. I'll probably do a story time video in the future about that, but guys. Oh my god, man. Holy, oh my god. I honestly almost lost it right there. Okay, okay. I need, I need to calm down. I need to collect myself. So, I'm scared of what this special booster pack is going to be, my guy. Like, I am honestly scared. Let's get into this next pack, though, and let's see, let's see what it is, bro. Okay, we got a Helioptile, Skiddo. I still can't get over that Mew, man. That card is freaking beautiful. That card is life, my guy. We got a freaking Go-Go energy switch and a vintage Hitmon top holographic. What are you doing to me, bruh? Oh, man, 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 man. And guess what, guys? This is also from the homie Austin. So Austin sent over two packages. He basically sent over his entire Pokemon collection that he had. Austin, my guy, I'm gonna have to give you something special because I don't know. I don't know if a Chinchou is just gonna cut it. You feel me? Like, I, I, I don't know, dude, because this Mew is freaking life right here. This Mew is the reason why I live in this earth. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but... It's freaking amazing, guys. It's freaking amazing. But we got the special booster pack left. I'm scared of what this is gonna be, y'all. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. I think I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay, let's see what it is. We got the Mewtwo GX right here. So we got a very, very nice Mewtwo to add to the collection. And we got the Mewtwo full freaking art. Oh, my God. Let me put it... Oh, it's actually stapled, unfortunately. But it's all good. Like I said, this card is freaking amazing. And I'm going to put it in a sturdier sleeve because it deserves a sturdier sleeve so it can be much more protected. But look at these booster packs. We opened up four booster packs and we got 
multiple Mew and Mewtwo cards. We got an Arceus Secret Rare, or Ultra Rare, I should say. We got a Hitmon Top Hollow, a vintage one. Oh my god, and all of this, too, with this Rayquaza, this is all from the homie Austin, my guy. That is freaking insane, dude. Oh, man, I, I need some time to collect myself, Austin. You're killing me, man. You're killing me, bro. We got to keep it going, though, guys. We got to keep it going. We got the next piece of fan mail right here. Money shots. Oh, okay, okay. I think this is for a signed card right here. Hold up, hold up. Let's see what this is. Dark Ghoul and Unlisted Leaf battles to see who the best PokeTuber will B. Dark Ghoul will win or not? Let's see. Pokemon Premium Collection Pack? What? I've never seen that before. And what's this card right here? Oh, we got a Greninja GX right off the bat. Y'all already know I love me my Greninja, man. And what's this? Letter. So let's actually check out the letter first before we... Oh, I'm strong. This is actually from Construction Paper, my guy. So you're a little fancy, you're a little bougie, you feel me? Alrighty guys, so let's see what the note says. I've been watching your video since 25,000 subscribers and I want you to sign a Greninja GX and I have a custom booster pack for you. I hope you will pull a Rainbow Charizard again. Did I just say Rainbow? A Rainbow Charizard again. Man, if I pull another Rainbow Charizard on the channel, I'm gonna go bananas, you feel me? And this is from the homie Nathan Stoney. P.S. I hope you get to 1 million subs. I appreciate the love, Nathan, man. You are the real MVP, and I love the last name Stony. That's actually pretty dope, honestly. You a stoner? Okay, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop, guys. It's a family channel. I gotta calm down. I gotta calm down. So he does want me to sign this Greninja, so I'm gonna put that to the side so I don't forget. And let's open up this Pokemon Premium Collection Pack, my guy. And let's see what's inside. Oh my god. Okay, let's go ahead. Okay, I'm gonna stop talking like that because I, I sound ridiculous. Okay, let's open this up. Come on. I can't open this, y'all. What the... Hold up, hold up, guys. Give me one second. Technical difficulties right now, my guy. Eventually. Alrighty, guys. So I finally got it open. And let's see what we get. So I think everything is in this sleeve. Oh, what? Hold up, hold up. We got a Dark Ghoul GX right here, man. Oh, hold up. The sleeve almost fell. That is freaking amazing, man. Dark Ghoul Premium Collection. That is definitely going into the fan binder, man. I, I freaking love this, guys. When you guys make stuff like this, it, it warms my heart, man. It's absolutely amazing. It's a rainbow rare, too. That's crazy. That's crazy. But let's see what we get in our booster pack, guys. We got a Trico. We got a Gumi. Love Disc. I absolutely love Disc. <laughs> okay, that was absolutely terrible. We got a Dusclops. And we got that Swampert Reverse Rare in the cut absolutely amazing i love the homie swamper because that's probably the only starter i choose in the hoenn region i don't like blaziken well i mean i like blaziken but i don't like using it as my starter and my brother always chooses septile so i always end up with mudkip you feel me so you know that was a nice little package appreciate the love nathan you are the real mvp next up guys we got another little package in case you guys are curious what my p.o box is it is right here but it's also in the description down below so let's see what we get out of here most of these letters are already pre-opened just so we save time you feel me so let's go ahead and take everything out of here and let's see what we get all right guys so the first thing that we got is a mew drawing and honestly that's adorable it reminds me of what do people call it like kawaii or something like that k-a-w-a-i-i -I. <laughs> I might have spelled it wrong but i don't know it reminds me of one of those like very very cute drawings of a certain person of a certain pokemon of a certain monster it just reminds me of something that's kawaii if that makes sense i know somebody's gonna know what i'm talking about so let me know in the comments down below if you know what i'm talking about very very cute drawing though i absolutely love it it reminds like i said and this is from the homie junior jr that's actually my brother's nickname so are you my brother no i'm just kidding but let's go ahead and check out the note i'm wildin y'all i'm wildin so let's see what this is I was thinking your vids are amazing and that you can sign my card and was wondering if you can send me some sleeves for other cards. And oh, by the way, I have drawn a Mew, so I absolutely love it. But you didn't insert any card, so I'm, I'm not sure what card you want me to sign. I don't know if it got lost or where it went, but there there's actually no card included into the letter. So uh, I, if you want, you sent over a letter for me to send back. If you want, I can just sign a random card, send it to you, you know, with the signed card and everything, but you didn't send over a card, so I'm not sure where it went, but I'll definitely send something your way since you did provide 
a letter and postage so i got you all right guys now the next package is basically a purchase that i made on facebook it says thank you see you again i don't know how you're gonna see me if we never met my guys so yeah, it's a little creepy but we got ourselves a couple vintage holographics for the collection we got a ride on brock's ride on we got erica's via plume we got a fortress in the cut is that even how you say the name fortress i don't even know let me know in the comments down below but we got the zapdos secret rare we got the moltres secret rare and we got the latios ex in japanese vintage ex card in the cut which is a delta species because this latios is a water type and it's absolutely beautiful it's not in mint condition but like i said when it comes to older cards i'm not really picky about the condition i just care if it looks good in a binder you feel me like if it looks beautiful when you're flipping through pages in my collection and honestly if you put this latios in a binder you're not going to notice anything it does have a few dents on the side but like i said those are only noticeable if you're trying too hard to look you feel me so guys we are now down to the final package for today's video and it is the actual box that we saw in the beginning of the video so now we're gonna see what's inside this box Alrighty, guys so i got the box right here we do have a grass energy right there and then we got some napkins or basically paper towels for protection so let's just go ahead and take that out and oh my god we got rice crispy treats what and i do believe this box is from the homie pete the collector so shout out to pete the collector i said that so i butchered your name i'm sorry but shout out to pete the collector coming through with the rice crispy cheats y'all want one y'all want one okay we got i think we got six of these on i'm shaking the camera left and right oh my god so we got six of those rice crispy treats and let's see what else we got let's actually throw these paper towels to the side let's see let's see i'm pretty sure this is like wrapping paper and whatnot yeah this is definitely wrapping paper this is definitely a letter so let me put that down and oh my god we got ourselves some manga is it manga or is it manga i'm, I'm pretty sure it's manga because that sounds right but oh my god we got tokyo ghoul what i know he told me that um if i wanted some manga of tokyo ghoul and i said sure i'll take some manga because i actually never actually read the tokyo ghoul manga and i heard it was really really good and i basically didn't really own as much manga as i did in the past like i, I had a couple books but i never really you know bought kept buying more and more and i do know you can get some of these at like barnes and nobles and i just wasn't sure what i should have gotten so you know the homie hooked it up got some of these tokyo ghoul books right here that is crazy we got toka i'm pretty sure it's toka if not then i'm stupid and then we got ken kaneki in the cuts absolutely amazing man absolutely amazing i love how these books look man i'm definitely gonna be taking a read on these obviously i'm gonna be starting with the first one and then moving on to book two so man this is crazy dude you did not have to send these because i know these aren't cheap man 12.99 that's crazy bro that is absolutely crazy so then we got an actual letter that we're gonna be checking out so let's see what it says everybody so is there anything else no there isn't we got a card right here but we're gonna take a look at the actual letter first everybody so let's see what it is all right guys so basically pete the collector i told him he didn't have to send any manga you feel me like he did not have to send anything but he said he was gonna send me some anyways it's cheap to buy manga off eBay because manga shot up to $12.99 a volume. I'm going to write some manga on the bottom of the page. Basically, recommendations and whatnot, his favorites and all that good stuff. Like I said, Pete the Collector, shout out to the homie. Check him out. Link is in the description down below because, you know, this guy's a very, very huge supporter of the channel. And he is just actually super super amazing everybody in this video is amazing bro and then we got some recommendations right here guys so if you guys want to check some of these out i really recommend you guys do the stars are basically his favorites i'm definitely going to check out death no dragon ball z i never thought the manga of dragon ball z would actually be decent i only watched the show and whatnot the anime but i'll definitely check out the actual reading of it and there's some of these that i've never heard of like i've never heard of the other side of secret other i can't think of but there are a lot i've watched like basically almost all of these in the anime version but i never read them you feel me so this is actually gonna be pretty crazy man it's gonna be pretty 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 crazy so i'm definitely gonna hang on to this as reference when i go to barnes and nobles so i can check out what is decent or on ebay because he said ebay is cheaper than going to like a bookstore and whatnot but guys we got the final card in today's video what's it going to be let's reveal it in three two one it's a zero sick full freaking art 
ending things off with a banger. That is crazy, man. I actually don't even own this car, too. Like, I'm pretty sure this is from XY Base. Hold up, hold up. Where is the freaking set symbol right there? I'm bad with my set symbols, y'all. I don't even know. Is that Flash Fire? <laughs> I don't even know, guys. All I know is I don't own this card, but I've owned, like, the uncommon version, but I've never actually physically pulled the full art, and now I'm physically holding it on my hand. So, Pete the Collector, man, you, you are absolutely amazing, my guy. I appreciate everything. Everything you guys send me. Like I said, you guys don't have to send me anything. A letter, a drawing will do. You guys don't have to send cards. You guys don't have to send books. You guys don't have to send treats. But obviously, if you guys do, I'm going to appreciate it so, so much. But without further ado, guys, we got a ton of heat in today's video. Just look at all of this freaking heat, man. Alrighty, guys, as soon as I was going to end off the video, my camera literally just cut me off because the video went over 30 minutes. So I'm going to try to get this video to basically as low as possible. I don't want to make it too, too long. So in the editing, it depends what I'm going to cut off, you know, what I'm going to keep and whatnot. But we got a ton of heat in today's video. We got the Articuno. We got Mewtwo. We got Mew. Oh, my God. I almost forgot about this Mew. Where is it? This freaking beautiful Mew. We got full art trainers. We got secret rares that I bought. I don't really want to, you know, put the spotlight too much on the cards I bought. I want to make the spotlight mainly on the cards you guys sent, like these custom ones right here. So without further ado, guys... I'm going to go ahead and end the video right here. If you guys did enjoy today's video, smash that like button. And without further ado, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Presence from Pidgey is officially back. Peace.